CJ, you got eight receivers in in the first half. That's a very competitive game, actually. That's about the most we've seen during, during your time here. Let's talk a little bit about the young guys. Uh, the young guys have great contributions. You know, they can make plays, that's why they're in the game. Whether it's you know, receiving, blocking, running after catch, or special teams, uh, they can all make plays, and that's why they're playing. Uh, the priority is not protecting the football anymore. It's definitely getting points on the board. We would much rather this year have the defense you know, be able to lean on us in close games and count on us to score as opposed to you know, punting and hoping our defense can stop them. How do you stay patient as an offense? Like the first two series, you score so quickly and then you have know, little balls in between and you know, big plays. And that's part of the ups and downs in the game. And that's things where you know the veterans like myself and Tommy can kind of talk to the offense and talk to each other about, hey, you know, we have another drive. But don't worry about that. Let that go in the past and just work on you know perfecting the next play. We're Sid Daniels after he had his first touchdown and then also his second in his career. I said, hey, it's, it feels great, doesn't it? <laughs> he definitely, I know it's something he wanted to do last year and being able to do it. I think his first catch this season. It had been a touchdown. So I said, I know he was happy and he was later. Your first time returning punts, so how different is it in the stadium full of 80,000 compared to, you know, over at LeBar on the practice field? I don't know. I wouldn't say it's that much different. Uh, I'd say the field surface played more of a difference than the crowd did. But it's definitely something I like doing. I enjoy being back there. And I would be each week I'm getting more comfortable. How do you think you did today? I think I did okay. You know, I stopped a couple balls from rolling, caught the balls that I could, tripped a couple times when I could have got, you know, what seemed to be a good bit of more yardage on the return. But uh, just working on keeping my feet. Man. You feel close to doing a little bit more than you actually totaled in the punt return game? Yes, I, I feel I'm really just keeping my feet. Not sure why I kept tripping today, but you know, once I can lace my shoes up right and <laughs> change something up, I definitely feel that I'm going to be uh, you know, a lot better in weeks to come. You were comfortable? And yeah, it was, it was real comfortable for me. I did it enough through camp, through the summertime, to where now, you know, you don't have to think about it. You just kind of react and play football. TJ, what did you see out of the pistol today? Things that you guys did well, things you wanted to move on before the next time you try it, as opposed to offense? Uh, with the pistol offense, I don't see that much of a difference from our normal offense. Uh, we have to work on, you know, run, being a little more effective in the run game, which comes with any formation that we run. And, and uh, I guess kind of making some of the plays downfield. Yes. We had a lot of plays made today, but there's always room for improvement. I don't think that the pistol or running the pistol has as much an effect on our offense as people may think.